Illinois voters are preparing to pick their top candidates to run for office this fall. The primary election is next Tuesday, and our political editor, Mark Maxwell, is helping us get to know the candidates. And so, Mark, what are you seeing in the race for attorney general? Mike, Attorney General Kwame Raoul is running unopposed for a second term as the Democrat. That was an open seat. You'll recall back in 2018 when Republican Erica Harold came the closest of any GOP candidate but still lost by 12 points. Now, four years later, Republicans are picking between Tom DeVore and Steve Kim. Many establishment, more moderate Republicans are warning the voters not to fall for the Democratic Party's latest campaign stunt. They're sending out these mailers. Maybe you saw them. They're boosting DeVore's profile, calling him, quote, too conservative. Not exactly an insult in a Republican primary. Kim feels Democrats are just toying with voters, meddling in this primary, and would love to face a candidate like DeVore in a general election. I am concerned with the temperament um, of Mr. DeVore. I believe uh, you know, these lawsuits that are out there, you know, including uh, his un unsuccessful lawsuit against uh, special education teachers because he called special education children window lickers. And those things are very concerning because I think the focus in November has to be the person that can beat Kwame Raul. And we can't have these distractions. Well, I would say if my temperament is any indication of all the work I've done for the last two years of fighting for hundreds of business owners, thousands of families, getting the masks off killed children, etc., if that's the temperament he's talking about, then I think I'm perfectly fit for the Office of Attorney General. Just a little more about their backgrounds. DeVore ran for school board once before and lost, almost ran for judge this time around, then jumped into this race most recently. His claim to fame is suing the Pritzker administration and landing a bunch of new clients during the pandemic. Kim built his resume in the Jim Edgar administration, also with Mark Kirk. Now he's a corporate lawyer for an electric vehicle battery company. He did run against Lisa Madigan for this same job back in 2010 and lost then. Mike. Mark, thanks. We